you had a little speech maybe at halftime to keep these guys fired up. You know, what, what kind of things did you say, and, and do you think it helped? Um, I don't know if it helped. I mean, I just I didn't like the kind of vibe we were having. Everyone was too happy, and it was only halftime. So uh, I just felt like I you know, had to just step up and make sure that we all got locked in for the second half. Too happy. What, what does too happy look like? Uh, it's just too many smiling, you know. I, I'm, you know, I play this game real seriously. I give it everything I got, and um, the game was far from over. We learned that from last week. So when I came in, I saw guys smile. I really didn't like it. So, uh, you know, I just want to make sure that we all came back down to earth and, uh, and and got the job done right. Kenny, you said after the UCF game, you needed to get Aaron one the other direction. Did you think it was going to come on another trick play though? Um, I don't know if it was gonna be the trick play, but I mean, we had that drawn up since spring. We've been running that play, so that's been in the you know been in the arsenal for a while. And, and Coach Wood did a great job of setting it up for us, and you know he was wide open. I just wanted to make sure I got it to him, and, and he finished it off. So he did a good job. It's kind of crazy that he hasn't had one yet, given you know everything he's contributed. How does it feel to to finally get him in the end zone? Right, it feels great. I was so happy for him. when I saw the flag on the ground. I was like, oh come on, man. And I wasn't even thinking about the team. I was like, man, this is Aaron's first touchdown. He's gonna get called back. So. Um, you know, I felt pretty confident that I was behind, you know, AJ. I just hitched up into the throw because I had to, you know, grab the ball. Um, yeah, so, I mean, it was, it was awesome to see him get in the end zone. You think the guys appreciated what you said at halftime? Yeah, I'm sure they did. You know, I'm sure they did. And if they didn't, you know, it's okay. We won the game. I don't need to be liked by everybody, um, you know, but they will all respect me because, you know, I give everything I have, and I feel like I'm a leader of this team. So, uh, you know, I said what I think need to be said. You got knocked around pretty good the first drive. It seemed like... That didn't stop you from from stepping into the throws. I mean, is that I know that's something that you take pride in, but how tough is that to do still? Yeah, I mean, it's easier, easier said than done, but um, you know, it comes it comes with the job. You know, it's it's in the job description. There's times you got to sit in there and, and, and take shots. Um, you know, but I think uh, Coach Board did a great job talking with the line. And, you know, we were communicating all game, trying to figure out what they were doing, just trying to slow them down. Um, you, know, you got to tip your cap sometimes because those two DNs are you know they're really good. I talked to those guys after the game. I told them you know they're great players and. Um, you know, they, they, they were a handful for us tonight in the show. Kenny, there was a, I think it was your guys' last drive in the second quarter. Good out, scored a touchdown, 23 seconds left. You had a, you know, hitting hit up with, uh, with French, but there was a third down that you checked out of, it looked like, into a running play to AJ. Third down. It's like third and four on your own 21. I was curious if you remember what you saw in that play. Yeah, right. I mean, I'm sure. Based on the checks we had this week, it was just a look, and it's a simple check. I've been making those checks since you know I was a freshman, and you know I, I think they're you know, they're pretty simple, and uh, it just gives us a chance to you know run it to the right side, you know, with the best look possible that we wanted. Um, you know, we had a few checks in, nothing, nothing nothing crazy, but I mean just simple stuff that you know we wanted to make sure that we were running the ball in the right front, and the right look. So uh, yeah, nothing crazy. You feel like AJ showed a little bit of maybe what he can contribute to this running game? The yeah, last absolutely. Of the season? I mean, we, we definitely missed him and Vince. You know, we missed both those guys. Um, you know, those, those last couple of games, and he's a huge piece to, to the offense, not only in the run game, but in the pass game. You know, he does a great job in protection, getting out of the backfield and making plays. Um, so it was great to have him back. Kenny, you said after the Duke game that you guys like to make things interesting. Yeah. Is, that, is that starting to wear a bit? I mean, yeah, you know? definitely starting to wear. And I think that's where the halftime, you know, I had to, you know, just get out there and, and say what I wanted to say and make sure that everyone was locked in. Because, um, you know, we got to learn how to win. And, there's a difference between learning how to win when it's a tie game and learning how to win and putting people away and, and just finishing the game you know, the right way. Um, so I think we're still trying to figure out how to do that. Any final for Kenny before we get to AJ? Do you think that final drive was encouraging, though, given how you guys did? Yeah, up? yeah, that's a huge step. Yeah, you're talking in the, in the fourth quarter or yeah. the second half? Or no, the first half. Fourth, fourth, fourth. fourth. Yeah, that's a huge step, a uh, huge step for us. And, you know, I looked at the line, and I was like, listen, this is on, you know, you guys, and, and AJ did a great job, and so did Ben, so. Um, you know, in the games like that, it's, it's with the guys up front. It's where you win in those games. That's where it starts. So uh, it was great for those guys. And that's a huge confidence booster for them moving forward. Kenny, thank you very much.